Welcome back, True Seeker. Turns out Drake and Kendrick Lamar are on the same record label. And again, studio gangsta rap battle diss tracks sell records. But um, again, their label, Drake and Kendrick Lamar, Universal Music Group. And you see this headline from a couple years ago. Drake signs LeBron-sized deal with Universal Music Group. Notice that was on the uh, real Machiavelli's birthday, May 3rd. Now there's this like Tupac theme and the beef between Drake and Kendrick Lamar. Kendrick Lamar put out the song on May 3rd, the real Machiavelli's birthday, 616 in LA when Tupac was claiming LA at the end of his life and his birthday was 616, June 16th. If you missed those videos, check it out. But the gematria always cuts through what some people might see as coincidence. Notice, Universal Music Group their label in Gematria equates to 263. That's the 56th prime number. As we know, 56, a very special number to the Jesuits and the Masons. And for example, here in the U.S., D.C., the capital city is known as the Masonic City. It's where the Jesuits set up camp when they came to America. If you're new here, we've been talking about these things for a long time and how these numbers come together all the time. Like why the Tupac album Machiavelli was put out on the Jesuit day, the day they tried to blow up British Parliament, Guy Fox day. You probably know about that through V for Vendetta. Big movie from the 2000s, from the same Matrix crew. They used to be the brothers, now they're the sisters, Wachowski. But yeah, the Machiavelli album came out on the day leaving 56 days left in the air. And again, Society of Jesus in Gematria equates to 56. Free May Sons, the plural, equals 56. D.C., the Masonic Jesuit stronghold, where they always put their hand on the Bible when they swear in. But they're all members of these societies where they take a different oath. A anyway, Drake, he's been rapping about LeBron since the beginning. LeBron, part of this world stage as well. Don't forget the ritual they did last year with King James on May 6th. Don't forget it, man. It was... It was Amazing. Again, the son of King James in history was King Charles on the day of King Charles' coronation, 5-6. Again, he was the first king of England since the last who died at age 56. And Gematria royal family equals 56 as well. But uh, on the king's 5-6 coronation, remember they, um, they had LeBron become 5-6 and six at home versus Curry in the playoffs. Again, the same men or the two men born in the same hospital in Akron, Ohio, that's Steph Curry and LeBron James. In their long playoff rivalry, LeBron became 5-6 and six at home versus Curry. That day, D'Angelo Russell, who was born in Kentucky, got his 56th win with the Lakers. The Brow, Anthony Davis, a real thoroughbred. It was 56 days after his March 11th birthday was that game, and he played at the University of Kentucky, and remember, the Kentucky Derby was that day. Kentucky Derby has that Gematria 56. And two of the favorite horses were in post five and six. And one of them was Kings Barnes. You know, Kendrick Lamar, he's one of these rappers who's worn the crown of thorns. They were showing that when they, when they put out the 616 headline with this Tupac connection. When Tupac went out in this Jesus ritual, his last music video, Him in Heaven, Tupac with all kinds of references in his music that he might not be here someday. You know, picture him rolling. But anyway, you guys, these record studios, if you haven't seen my work on Tupac's death and just how, again, why he died on Caesar Borgia's birthday, where white Jesus comes from, how all this stuff relates to history, ritual, important dates, the real Machiavelli faked his death. You know, remember, um, remember Tupac was always rapping about Caluminati at the end, Caluminati. Like Illuminati. Again, the Illuminati was founded by the Jesuit, Adam Weishaupt, May 1st, 1776. Their symbol is the all-seeing eye, which has that gematria of 56. Like Washington, D.C. equals 56. Like 56 signers on the Declaration of Independence. So anyway, they're on this label that has this 263 gematria, the 56 prime. And this shooting goes down on 56 date numerology. So repetitive. In the world of hip-hop, you can get into it with Biggie and many more. But uh, I didn't want to go too long on this video. Keep this about five minutes. I'll do a stream later when I get a chance. But uh, 
Again, same old patterns. Go back and find my video on Tupac's death and his record label. You'll see we're talking about the same numbers. 56 in a big way. Until next time, True Sicker.